Hello friends, today we will be doing Math Kangaroo level 5 and 6, year 2022, question number 28. This is a five-pointer question. Means it's, this question is for five marks for the exam. Question 28 reads as follows. The four villages A, B, C, D lie along a road in that order. The distance between neighboring villages is 10 kilometers. There are 10 students who live in village A, 20 students who live in village B, 30 students who live in village C and 40 students who live in village D. The villages want to build a school so that the total distance traveled by the students when going to school is as small as possible. Where should they build the school? So let's see the information given is, there are these villages A, B, C, D, and they are all 10 kilometers apart. Okay, and Now there are 10 students in village A, there are 20 students in village B, and there are 30 students in village C, and there are 40 students in village D. The villages want to build a school so that the total distance traveled by the students when going to the school is as small as possible. Now, so let's just start with options. Suppose if the school is built in A, so if the school is built in A, then the total distance traveled would be for uh, students in village A will be zero. Students in village <clears throat> B will be, they'll be traveling. So 20 students will travel 10 kilometers. So total distance will be 200 kilometers. Uh, so the students in C will travel, 30 students will travel 20 kilometers. So that will be 600 kilometers total. And then if you talk about D, so 40 students will travel 30 kilometers. So that will be 1200 Kilometers. So the total distance traveled will be 2,000 kilometers. Now, uh, let's see if the school was built in B. Uh, so the people, the villages A will have to travel, 10 students will travel 10 kilometers. So that will be 100 kilometers. Students in B will travel 0 kilometers. Students in C will travel, 30 students will travel 10 kilometers. So that will be 300 kilometers. Student in D will travel. So 40 students will travel 20 kilometers. It will be 800 kilometers. Total distance travel will be 1200 kilometers. Now, if the school is built in C, okay, so students of A village will travel 20 kilometers. So that will be 200 kilometers. B will travel, so 20 students will travel 10 kilometers. So that again will be 200 kilometers. Students in C will travel 0 kilometers. For D, it will be 40 students will travel 10 kilometers, which will be 400 kilometers, a total of 800 kilometers. And if the school is built at D, so students of A, which is 10 students, will travel 30 kilometers, which will be 300 Students of B will travel 20, so 20 students will travel 20 kilometer, so that will be a 400 kilometer. Students of C, so 30 students will travel 10 kilometers, so that again will be a 300 kilometers, and D will travel Z. So total distance traveled would be 1000 kilometers. Okay, uh, let me just write this. So if the school is uh, School at A, in that case, the distance traveled is 2000. If the school is at B, the distance traveled is 1200. If the school is at C, then it is 800. And if the school is at D, then it is 1000 kilometers. But here there's one more option that if it is built, uh, let's just write here. So if it is school A, it is 2000 kilometers. If it is B, then it is 1200. This is something that we need to find. In case it is C, then 800 kilometers. And if it is uh, D, then it is 1000 kilometers. Let's just clear this off. So let's see for option C, like if the school is in the middle of B and C. So suppose if it is in the middle of B and C. So suppose let's just take this as 5 kilometers and 5 kilometers. So let's see how much distance uh, students A will travel. So A will travel, 10 students will travel 15 kilometers. 
So that will be 150 kilometers. B will travel 5 kilometers. So that will be 20 into 5, another 100 kilometers. C will travel 30 students will again travel 5 kilometers. That will be 150 kilometers. And D will travel 10 and 15. So 40 students will travel 15 kilometers. That will be a 600 kilometer. So total will again be uh, 300 will be 1000 kilometer. So in this case, it will be 1000 kilometer. So they are saying where is the total distance traveled by the students as small as possible. So as small as possible is an option C, which is 800 kilometers. So my answer for this question will be option B. As in the school needs to be built in C, but the option D is the right answer. So I hope you understood this question and I please like, my, like this video and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.